Hello, Scorpio. If you're dealing with a Scorpio or you are a Scorpio, then you come to the right place. This is your reading. Sought Intuition Tarot. Y'all like, subscribe, comment, as well as share. If you haven't subscribed, I'd appreciate it if you would. Don't forget to hit the thumbs up. This uh, increases the views on my video. So here we go, Scorpio. First card is them. Ace of Wands. How they feel. They want to get it going with you. They want uh, to come towards you. They want a new start with you. Let's clarify the Ace of Wands. They feel like you may be looking elsewhere. Or maybe you've thought they've looked elsewhere for love. Let's see if that's the case. They do feel like they don't know what to do because maybe you've got the wrong impression of them. What you've thought about them with the Eight of Swords. Uh, they don't want you to feel that way about them because they've not been looking elsewhere. Uh, they feel all in their head because you're not wanting to give them a new start. So what is conflict? Communication. Not uh, making time out for each other to travel toward each other. Maybe y'all uh, haven't found the time to uh, spend with each other. That looks like that's the conflict. Talking, texting, things of that nature. Let's see uh, how you feel about the situation. You feel like it would be a happy union. Uh, someone you could possibly settle down with. So you're happy about it with the Nine of Cups. Judgment. Uh, you have judged the situation and you do feel like... Uh, It'd be a good commitment. And you're going to, you find them very attractive and you want to go toward them. Looks like you do want to go toward this person, Scorpio. All right, let's go to the actions. What actions do y'all need to take in order for this to come to fruition? Well, the actions is y'all haven't been taking actions. Just been sitting around thinking about it, keeping you up at night. Nine of Swords. Uh, just thinking about the situation in your head doesn't mean that you can move it forward. So maybe, what can y'all do to move this forward, Scorpio? Y'all come to a, uh, you know, come to a common ground with the Six of Swords. Try to come together. Uh, move toward each other. Travel toward each other. Looks like y'all need to so you can communicate. That'll, that'll make it very stable if y'all do. If you do open lines communication, uh, make a date with each other. Start going out and doing things. What would be the outcome of the situation? Three of Pentacles. Want to make it work. Trying everything you can. Uh, this is juggling. Uh, you know, juggling work, home, uh, dating life. Trying to put that person in the mix of your life let's clarify the three of pentacles but you're waiting you're waiting to do that so it looks like both y'all are waiting with the nine of wands you're waiting this is a wounded warrior this is uh someone that's you know got a lot on their plate and they're just waiting you're afraid that this is not going to make you happy that this ultimately won't be stable. Or one of y'all are, are thinking that way. Why is that? Why are y'all thinking that way? You feel like there's a lot of obstacles with the chariot card. This is cancer. Uh, energy. You're waiting uh, for the go-ahead. For the green light. You know there's obstacles. And maybe you feel like you want to travel toward them, but you feel like there's obstacles here. But you're going to be able to get over them if that's what you're worried about. And you're waiting. That's waiting for your ships to come in. Waiting for an answer. Waiting for a call. Waiting for the go-ahead. So what advice? Hmm. Five of Wands. Stop making this a competition. This is not a competition. You know, five of wands, if you you think this is a competition, see who comes in first. Or who's going to commit? try to communicate first. Sorry, cards fell on the floor. But make us feel 
somebody's going to feel left out in the cold in this situation with the five of pentacles and uh this you're gonna have to drop these burdens drop the burdens uh so people need you're gonna have to sacrifice in order to have this commitment if that's what you want somebody's gonna have to sacrifice give in a little bit travel toward each other uh, y'all are out looks like y'all are in your head you don't know what to do you do want to travel toward each other and communicate but you're just sitting there waiting so you somebody's gonna have to sacrifice in order for this to come together will that happen for scorpio will this happen Okay, the more time you take away with the Hermit card, the more they're going to think you're leaving your options open. You can vice versa. This situation is going to cause a tower. It's going to cause an upset uh, with y'all's relationship. You know, the more no contact you have, somebody's going to think you got your options open. You're waiting for a better option or they're not a good option for you. And it's going to cause a tower. So, if this is something that you want, you're going to have to make some effort to go forward. I don't know. I mean, and it'll be successful if you do, okay? This card is success. Six of wands. It'll be successful. What else we need to tell Scorpio? Cards just will not stay in my hand. They want to fly on the floor. So, here we go star uh staying hopeful that you're going to be the vic you're going to you're going to have victory in the situation so you feel like you're going to have victory in the situation well when are you going to when are you going to have victory give us a timeline when scorpio will have victory over this situation that's Aquarius energy, the star card. When you end the conflict, when you see them for the independent person that you know they are, or they see you as something that's worth moving toward, so you can get this union together. So, uh, y'all need to end whatever conflict or whatever is stopping y'all from moving toward each other. Because, you know, this is a strong, independent person, you feel like, that you would like to come together with. And the only way to make that happen is to move towards someone. Give it all you got, okay? Because there will be stagnation. person's going to feel, or you're going to feel like, the more they don't talk to you, the more they don't get this going, uh, you're going to start doubting the relationship or the connection and feel like, well... They must not really like me, and they're keeping their options open. But, you know, these cards say otherwise, okay? If y'all just make an effort to move toward each other, looks like this will be a success. And again, the advice is, this ain't a competition. You're going to feel left out in the cold if you think of it as one. You need to drop in burdens. Uh, sacrifice so you can have a commitment that you want if that is what you truly want all right y'all that was your reading salt intuition tarot like share comment as well as subscribe